Anticipation is growing for the first presidential debate set for next Monday at Long Island's Hofstra University. Turns out beer lovers will have something to toast as well, thanks to our first president's taste for hops. TV tempted to have Long Island Bureau Chief Richard Rose has tonight's Long Island Report. Brewmaster Dan Jansen is among the first to sample the latest newcomer to locally brewed beers. It's called Colonial Ale. And believe it or not, its creation at the Blue Point Brewery in Patchogue was inspired by the man on the dollar bill, our first president, George Washington. And we found out he was a, he was a brewer himself. In 1757, he had penned a recipe for a small beer in a military journal. This is a copy of the actual recipe currently held inside the archives of the New York City Public Library. Jansen says he faithfully followed Washington nearly 260 year old instructions to brew 30 barrels of the beer. And we used some corn and some oats and some wheat as well as some white molasses syrup. Jensen adds the ale is also a nod to a visit Washington made in 1790 just a half a mile away in Patchogue where a cemetery now lies. Local legend has it that he stopped at a tavern that once stood here where he enjoyed a meal of oysters and beer. I wouldn't even think that there would be a connection with George Washington and Patchogue so that's interesting. Even longtime locals are unaware of the Washington Patchog connection, but say they're willing to give this old new ale a chance. I'm sure they won't stay totally with the old style. Maybe they'll bring it a little up to date, but I'd be willing to try it. The brewers say the only real difference is the modern equipment they used, and Colonial Ale will see its modern day debut on Monday for guests inside Hofstra University's hospitality tent just before the presidential debate. Well, I certainly think it's something everybody can agree on. You know, that's not always the case with debates and, and politics, but I think beer brings people together. Even across the centuries. In Patchogue, Richard Rose, TV 1055. After the debate, Colonial Ale will be available inside the Patchogue Brewery's tasting room. If it's a hit, you'll see it later in the stores. Cool.